It's just you guys. Just who I want to speak to. Okay. Here we go. How you guys doing? If you don't know who I am, my name is Brandon Taylor. Welcome to my channel. So we need to talk, okay? I know you guys are seeing the title and I know you guys are like, what the heck is happening? Well, I will explain everything. Just please give me a moment, okay? I need to talk about a few things. And me being uh, an influencer, if you will, or a YouTuber or a social media creator, whatever you want to call me, I have a due diligence. I have a job to do. And that is to be a role model and to help you guys. And I feel like over these past few months, I have lost sight on who I am supposed to be my jobs to do, and, and more importantly, I lost the sight of who I am as a person. And I need to go backtrack. I need to backtrack things, I need to rewind, and I need to talk. So that's what this video is gonna consist of. It's gonna be me talking. Over the past years of me being an internet person, I have realized how young and fun and awesome all of you are. But at the same time, I know that you guys are people and there's things that you guys go through just like me. I am a person as well and I have opinions on things. They may not always be right, but they're my opinions and I have feelings and I have problems in my life too. A lot of you are so young and the stuff that I say sometimes is not always the best things to say because some of you look up to me as a role model. You know, you watch my videos because you're sad and I make you happy. I bring entertainment to your life and I don't know what I've been thinking that I can do certain things that I shouldn't be doing and I wanna just apologize. I want to say I'm sorry for a lot of things that I've done in the past. I have done more things than I can name on this video right now because I just mess up a lot. I, I make mistakes. I do stupid stuff because just like you watching this at home, I'm just a dude living life. You know, like I, I make mistakes. I'm not perfect. I appreciate everyone who supports me so much through this whole thing. Like you guys are honestly my rock and without you guys, I honestly do not know where I would be because before all this happened, I was working a nine to five job, making $10 an hour, slaving away in a mechanic shop, melting during the summers, freezing during the winters, but I was doing what I could as well as going to school and stuff. But listen, that's not important. What I wanted to talk to you guys about is this past week has been the worst week of my life. I just fell into a rut. I fell into a dark hole and I have just been super depressed, if you will. I've been sad. I don't know. I've just not been myself. And it has taken me until this moment right here when I'm filming this video. I want to check this moment. It is 520 on April 9th, 2018. I have realized that I need to take control of my own life. And I want you guys to do the same thing, okay? I realized some things this morning while I was driving. I realized that I know what people who feel like crap a lot of the time are feeling like. I, I understand now because I was feeling like crap and I get that maybe you don't want to talk about it because you don't want to be a bother to someone else or you don't want to put your problems on someone else or you just maybe don't want to open up. I was there. I've been there and it's It's I'm sorry I said a bad word. I, I'm going to cut that out. It sucks. It's not fun. And I don't want any of you guys to go through that anymore. So I wanna open up my audience to everyone, okay? So this is where I wanna turn just a fandom into a community, into like a place where friends can come and watch my videos together. I want everyone in the comments to become friends with each other and talk to each other. Like, I am always here. If you guys ever need to talk about something, I am here for you, I am ready to listen. But sometimes it's hard. There's a lot more of you guys than there is me. So that's why I wanna turn this audience that I have into something better than that. I want you guys to help each other. When there's someone who needs you, help them out in the comments, compliment each other, become friends. I want everyone to be a huge fandom who's like friends with each other. Like I've seen people in the comments like fight each other before and I don't want that. I've seen fans fight other fans and I don't want that. I want everyone to just get along, be friends and help each other out because you know, we all go through things and maybe just you being nice to one person could honestly change their whole day, change their outlook on things, and maybe possibly save their life. You never know. And that's why I'm here. I wanna help you guys. I wanna change who I am because I don't even like the person that I was becoming. So that's why I need to make this video because I needed to sit myself down and I needed to really slap some sense into myself. Life is all about how you perceive it and I know you guys are probably like, I've heard this a million times. It's true. A positive mind is a positive life. 
So what I'm trying to say is let's all be positive. Let's stop focusing on the negatives and let's actually make a change for the better because I felt like crap for the past week. I felt like nobody was there to listen to what I had to say. And I know I could have turned to you guys, but I don't want to be that person who promotes feeling bad because I want you all to feel good. I want you to feel your best. I want you to be able to be comfortable in your own skin and be the most confident version of you. I want the world to love you all for the reasons that your friends and your family love you all because you're you, you're different, you're you, you know what I'm saying? You're perfect. And basically I know I'm rambling here, but what I'm trying to say is I want to become a close knit community with you guys. Like I want us to all be really close. I want us to be on a friend level. I don't want a screen to separate us. Okay. I want to feel like we're all a big family here. And lately I just like seen a lot of drama been going on and I feel like I haven't been connecting to you guys a lot. So this is where I'm going to say that my Twitter DMs, I'm going to open them up. I'm going to let anyone and everyone DM me whenever they need to. I'll always be checking my Instagram DMs. I'm going to be checking everywhere to support you guys because you guys have given me, I don't know, two, three, maybe four years of support. The least I can do is support you guys back. And I want to get better at that. I want to start checking my DMs a lot more. I know I already do, but like, I feel like I could be doing a lot more. I feel like I waste a lot of time doing dumb stuff that I shouldn't be doing. So I'm sorry. I'm here and I'm going to change. I want to go back to the old ways, you know? I want to have fun with you guys. I want to do fun things, you know? I want to I want to enjoy what I do again. And I lost sight of that over the past, but I'm I'm realizing it and I'm working towards fixing it. So I hope you guys can forgive me for that. And I know now it's time. It is time to talk about my title, okay? <sighs> And I know this is what you guys have been waiting for and I know I've been rambling in the beginning. Well, fine, okay, here, let's just talk about it. Let's get it over with, so yes. The title is true, Kira and I have broken up. We are no longer together. The reasons for that is, there, there's a lot of reasons and I really don't wanna get into too many because she's not here and I don't wanna like spill a story without her being here to like, you know, talk about her feelings as well. So I'm just gonna say that the reason for us being broken up is a private matter, but uh, what I am gonna say is that Kira was an awesome girl. You know, she was super fun, lighthearted, and really cool. And I will always admire her kindness, her sweet personality, but sometimes uh, people have differences and it made the relationship impossible. Like, it just didn't work out. We, we tried and it's unfortunate, but you know, things happen. Life goes on, and I just want to say thank you guys for supporting us when we were a thing, and I appreciate you guys just being so accepting. That's like another thing that I really appreciate about you guys, is you guys are always so accepting on who I bring into my videos or into my life, and that's why I really appreciate all of you, because you guys showed respect, you guys were kind, you guys were nice, you guys didn't say like mean things, and I appreciate that, you know? Sometimes when you see the person that you, you really admire and you really like, with someone else, it, it, it can offend some people, and I understand where those people were coming from, and I'm sorry that that you felt that way at that time, but I just wanna reiterate that I am thankful for the relationship, and I am thankful for all of you who were there to support the relationship. So yeah, that's kind of all I wanted to say on this subject. Again, I just wanna throw out there, I'm sorry for anything that I have ever done that has offended someone, multiple people, a lot of people, I'm sorry. I'm just human, you know, I'm, I'm trying to do the best that I can every day that I can and sometimes I lose sight of what I should be doing and I'm sorry. I'm gonna work at that and I'm gonna really try to change as a person to better myself as a person, not change and be different, but change and be better. And I challenge all of you to do the same thing. So if you're stuck in a rut, let's get a shovel and let's crawl out together because we can do this as a family. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I love you all from the bottom of my heart. I'll never forget that. I'll be back maybe tomorrow or the next day with a new video. I don't know yet, depending on if I can knock something out really quick, but it's gonna be good, it's gonna be fun, and I appreciate you all. Thank you so much. You have a blessed day and be awesome. I don't know what the peace sign was for, it just felt right. Okay, I'll see you guys later, peace. Hey guys, this is a new challenge that I'm creating. It's called the 10 second Handstand. Can you do it at home? Let me know. Because I can't. This brick is calling me. 
apple? Hello? Make sure you guys check out yesterday's video and also make sure you hit that subscribe button right now and turn on post notifications so you never miss a post. Follow me on my other social medias and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.